Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryda Matalo and we're here with another Grand Theft Auto V PC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content and we're gonna get straight into the video. Welcome back guys, this video is all about on how to install your working Wastelander inside Grand Theft Audio V. So like always, make sure you do download all of the requirements that's in some of the description below. And make sure that all your requirements is the latest version. Once you have completed that, then install all your requirements as well. Once you guys have completed that process, then download this mod. I will leave this mod in some of the description below so you guys can download it. I have already downloaded this mod, so I don't need to download it. Once you guys have completed all that process, then go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click, and open file location. As you guys can see, I have already installed all my requirements. Head over to your scripts folder. Make sure you've got a native UI.dll file inside your script folder as well and make sure it's the latest version. Go to your working wastelander extract folder. Open up your working wastelander folder and then now uh, click on working wastelander.dll file and then paste it inside your script folder. Exit out of your extract folder and go back to your main Grand Theft Auto V folder right click refresh your folder exit the other out of your game folder right click refresh your desktop and then i'll see you guys in the game and we are back with franklin guys so to use the working wastelander guys all you got to do is press f8 go to vehicle options go to vehicle spawner go to services services and go right down the bottom and there goes the wastelander Spawn the Wastelander, okay, and then now just park it on its side for a bit. Press F to exit out of the vehicle, and then now let's go and find a vehicle. We're going to use our own. And now all you got to do, okay, guys, is just go closer to the working Wastelander and press E, and there you go. Jump out of the vehicle, and now press F over here, and now you're good to go. This mod is basically good for role plays. When you're doing a role play, you can do a role play on transferring vehicles to one place to another, like from one company to another. Or it is good for showcase and etc. And just to let you guys know too that the vehicle does stay on there, even though if the wastelander goes upside down, the vehicle still stays on there. So the vehicle will not come off the truck if you guys want to detach it okay all you got to do is stop on the side of the road okay let's see again and see guys there you go the vehicle comes out nice and perfect and now you guys can basically drive around the car on the vehicle but yes this mod over here is basically good for for role plays or showcase or etc or if you're doing a movie or a film it's good for making videos so yeah just let you guys know before I do leave okay is to make sure that you download all other requirements that's in some of the description below and make sure that you install all the requirements too and make sure that your requirements is the latest versions too. Make sure to create a scripts folder as well. And make sure that you do have a native UI dot DLL, the latest version too. So guys, I hope you guys do enjoy this video. And I do upload daily GTA V PC modding tutorials videos and other uh, GTA V videos too as well. So with that all said guys, I hope you guys do enjoy this video. If you guys did, then smash that like button and subscribe if you guys are new here. And I'll see you in my next video. Thank you for watching guys. Peace and I'm out.